Hello everybody, welcome back to Balatro. We were we were popping off last time. I was having a great time. Shall we run black deck again? I mean, there, there's no guarantee we're gonna get the same sort of setup, but minus one discard is like a huge negative, don't get me wrong. Considering that the black deck only has three hands to start with anyway. I think, listen, guy who's won once recently with the black deck, I think it's a, one of the most overhated decks in the game for me. Because all you need is one amazing joker in your first shop. And as long as you get one amazing joker immediately, you're off to the races. God is my witness. I think 10-4 is more reliable than a buffoon pack. Obviously, the buffoon pack has higher potential upside. I mean, this is insane. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten is is certainly going to get us there with with ten four. Now you you can, in my personal opinion, you can build around ten fours. I I love, I respect red card. Taking a red card, having great econ, and never buying anything from packs is actually a reliable way to get flat malt. But. You know, what do you sell for two? Buy it for five, four bucks, skip it, three malt. No, I, I think it's just the wrong time. It does suck up all your econ. It's an interesting way to play the game. I love Fortune Teller. I hope it shows up later, but for now, I think we got to save. Okay, tens and fours. Obviously, that's not going to happen. I will play a full house, which is basically like playing a productive discard right now. It's honestly like great flush chances, even though there's no 10 and no 4. There's a 10, which means we probably just make it. But just a li the chips aren't nothing, but just a little bit of flat malt early is... Provides you with great peace of mind. I'll be honest with you, this to me, idle might be insanely valuable later, but we can't promise that. So for now, we just skip. We play 10, 10, 4, 4. Close to an ideal hand for us right now. 10, 10, 10, 4, 4 would be better. 10, 10, 10, 10 would probably be better, but I mean, it's pretty good. I think we could start taking a chance on some Arcana packs with no Jokers available. I don't mind turning a 3 into a 10. And then, you know, as we stand here, why not let this one fly? Just about to say, another death card would go crazy. The money would go crazy too, but more tens and more fours where it really counts. And then the, the steal, I think, is valuable later. Turn a seven into a ten. Turn both of our tens into bonus cards. Now, we're definitely at the point, by the way, where I would love to get, uh, like, another joker. You could take that up with Local Thunk. I didn't program the shop. I, I have to buy what's available in the shop. Okay, now I would be careful what you wish for because our jokers are like useless. I will buy Hallucination out of necessity. And I'm going to buy the Celestial Pack. I'm praying. They, I, it, it wasn't what I wanted, but I'll take it. Any kind of Molt and Chips bonus here can help us out. We're not even thinking about Anti-6, much less Anti-8, much less Endless, okay? So right now, we dump one. We got a full house already. I'm going to make a 10 wild just in the future. Maybe we can play a flush house. For now, we're just chilling. This may not get us there in one play. It did. It, it, it did by 50%. Okay, we need a joker, bro. Come on, help me out. Okay. They're, they're, they're pushing me to the edge, man, because I love Vagabond. I'm not not going to take Vagabond. That's a given. So we will run a discard. We will run a discard. And then let me see what we're cooking with here. 10, 10, 10, 4, 4. It's the best hand in human history. How about Queen, Queen, 8? How do you feel about that? I feel like it's a free tarot card. That's how I feel about it. And then how about 888 ace? Now the game is bending to my will. Now you just gotta be, you gotta, you gotta keep things on the level, okay? But we can, Vagabond is gonna cost us a little bit economically, but it's also gonna give us some serious deck fixing power. 
Now, hopefully, I'll be able to buy the voucher because it's like my favorite voucher in the game. <laughs> it would be nice. 10 10. Ace Ace. This is good. I'm of two minds about things. Me personally. Three, four. We'll have two hands left. I could sell Hallucination to get the voucher if I have to. Here's what I'm, I'm, I'm thinking you don't worry about Vagabond. And you play your, your full house. That doesn't get us there. Okay, well now we do worry about Vagabond because there's nothing else to do. Well, Scratch, I would just say we worry like in general. Because <laughs> what am I going to play, bro? I'll tell you straight up, I'm not playing 10-10-2-2. When 10 10 ace 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 wasn't enough. A sun card, huh? Well, <laughs> I could be persuaded to play 10 10 10. Work with me. That one stung. That, that, that hurt me. Disgusting. This is a disgusting series. What, what's what's our... All clubs are debuffed? Okay, so we'll... For In lieu of a guaranteed better option, we'll do this. And you know what? We got $4 and a bad tarot card in the whole scheme of things. Like, it's a little, it's a little bit of cope, don't get me wrong. But you actually can do worse than that by playing a small blind that gives you no outright rewards. The thing is, after that, you do get to see a shop and you have enough money to usually buy like one Joker. But we have that now as well. So that's why it's gambling, bro. Sometimes it works out, sometimes it doesn't. I'm, I simply refuse to buy a, an eternal hallucination, a Joker that never works for us to begin with. Even though it did like four times in a row on the last run. Just give me a judgment, bro. That's why I'm opening packs, because I'm desperate. I'm desperate, man! 12 bucks? We could reroll by a Joker. 100 chips on three of a kind? 100 chips on three of a kind? Actually, not useless. <laughs> 8, 9, 10, Jack. How could you? But I will say, it is like a... It's so close to a straight flush. Even debuffed, it probably gets us there. I know. It's a little galaxy brain, right? It doesn't count. <laughs> well, in that case, I'll, I'll hit you with the default aid. Uh, we're, we're, this is a hold our situation. We're, we're cooked. Okay, how about some jokers this time? How about some jokers? Imagine that... This, this would be a full house that wins in one. Hmm, I, I, was, I was thinking if a king came, but maybe the eight still gets us there. Oh, okay. Six bucks total. We're balling. They hate me. It's the only explanation. They, they hate me. I'm not buying an eternal plus 12 molt joker at this stage of my life. I will... Take a couple of hands to win, but hopefully at least get $3 out of it. Although I'm realizing I shouldn't have made you gold just yet. You lose a dollar to play this, but if you get the flush, you get $3 out of it. I resent that I'm now thinking carefully instead of just playing on vibes, but please, a joker. I mean, DNA is an amazing joker. If we had, like, any cards worth duplicating at all. It's risky, man. I mean, we gotta, we gotta do something. The other joker doesn't give us score either, so what do we care? Literally, I forgot we were on a boss blind where the DNA effect is completely countered, so there is that. Here we go. I'm starting to understand that the negatives of the, uh, of the black deck. Okay. Tell you what. 
Two more sixes. And then the, the planets could be very useful early. Gold cards too, but I would prefer like if it was a gold, like a devil card we held in hand so that we could um, guaranteed get value out of it right away. It's a flush, bro. It's, it's the easiest hand to make in the game. We do have five, six, seven, eight, nine, but honestly, we've, we've leveled up flush. We should try to send a flush. Normally flush straight, I, I, you know, six of one, half a dozen of the other, but this is a, a different type of situation. The game's messing with us. We got to mess with it back. This is good. Square Joker, not maybe my tempo, but Droll Joker. Okay, Droll Joker is something to look forward to here. We can not play four cards. So get that out of your head right now. Just enjoy the 16 chips. This is going to be 16 moat, but we're going to clear it so easily. Now, Square Joker, we can build with it. This is another judgment, which goes crazy. A Abstract Joker even is like... Holy cow. I, no, this is insane. Give me abstract joker. It, it's it's a reliable flat molt. We're not talking about endless, okay? It's a reliable flat molt. We'll take it. Now we can play four, a flush of four. And that's fantastic. Which I think to me means that we can now build econ like crazy. So literally start with nothing. This is not Econ, sorry, this is gonna be chips. It literally gains four chips per attempt, which is nothing, but... It's four times 12 times 10. So it, it adds up, okay, it adds up. The catch is, this is gonna be really bad for our Econ. So how do we get around that? I think the answer is actually quite simple. We um, buy an Econ Joker, like a rocket or a golden egg or something like that, if one was so kind as to show up. 32 chips, huh? Not an Econ Joker, we pass. Otherwise, we got to rely on interest. And honestly, you, you, you put me in a difficult position here. I'm just going to make sure I got to take care of myself before I take care of anything else. Beautiful. We're definitely going to make it. So toss him some dookie again. This feels good, right? <laughs> it feels head empty, which is what I like. Now, we're not going to take ride the bus. I am very tempted to. Maybe a mega buffoon pack just because it could give us an econ joker, but it's a big spend. It's a spend that's more than I'm, I'm willing to spend. And truth be told, I don't think any of these are, are super good for us. So I'm gonna, uh, I should have taken the, the rare to buy and sell. But I'm just gonna add Swashbuckler to the end. Pretty, pretty basic, don't get me wrong. But, I mean, you know what we're, we're building towards here. It's, it's a beautiful thing. That's what it is, it's a beautiful thing. I accidentally played a pair. Oh, look at Lottie Da, Mr. Doyle Brunson started to play some real poker hands. Not just throw out four random cards for no reason. Come on, econ me. They've chosen not to econ me. What do we do? Start cutting a suit. Eventually, we're going to want to make better hands. Bro is allergic to econ, I'll admit. Face cards give 30 chips each. It's not nothing. I'm not sure if it's something, but it's not nothing. Okay, we, we were cutting spades. So, I mean, if we're going to win anyway, maybe you just play a flush, but what, what do we... It literally doesn't... Oh, it mattered! Let's go, bro! We can play five of those. Okay. We need economics. You know what we need? Business card. Business card. Earn an extra dollar of interest for every five dollars you have. I'll just level with you. I don't think we're in a position to be making enemies. This may help accelerate our, our earnings, which is important. Because we don't have a, a true econ joker. 
6,400 points. We make it. But the reason we're playing Garbage Hands... By the way, if you, maybe you're watching and you're like, I don't know what's going on in this Balatro game. Fair enough. Um, if you've watched a few episodes, you probably get the gist of it. Our win condition right now is get as many chips as possible from Square Joker. Tempting. Very... Almost tempting enough to get me to abandon my idea, but... So in order to do that, we're kind of throwing our economics out the window temporarily or trying to find an alternative means of getting good economics by um, playing every single hand until we're down to zero, for better, for most of the time at least. Which allows us to get as many chips as possible out of Square Joker, which then gets multiplied by our mults. At some point, we drop Droll Joker and Swashbuckler for a better flat mult enabler. Abstract is pretty nice, I'll admit. Especially when he embellishes on the cut. Mm, I think it's a discard situation. Let's let's aim for some diamonds. Because spades have been cut from our deck. That, a little bit, but may, en enough that I don't want to make the mistake of relying upon them. I'm not even scared in the slightest. Right? <laughs> I am... Well, that was getting a little close for comfort. Okay. Maybe it's time to start being sane. But look at, by the way, look at the value of To The Moon, bro. To The Moon hooked us up. We're going to the moon, just like it said. I'll tell you what, Droll Joker, you're gone. Now we, we, have, we have a sense of purpose. The, the builder and the architect arrive with a sense of purpose. We now wish to play Club Flushes. Yeah. Play only one hand type this round. Shouldn't be a problem. Discard these. Club flushes, please. We only need four, bro. You only need four clubs. <laughs> and I can only play one hand type. Thank God we at least got four diamonds out of it. We still didn't get a club. We have to get a club on the next one. We got one club. Like, I'm actually... I'm shocked at your hubris that you would try to screw me like that, but... You know what? Now we know where we stand. Now we know where we stand, so we can start to build off of it. Okay, I understand. There's no, there's no friends in this. There's no crying in baseball. Would have been nice. I am kind of due. Cheaper rerolls will help us buy more tarot or planet cards later, and we could use both of them, probably. So now... I think we gotta start kind of getting pot committed. Like, we gotta start trying to play as many club flushes as possible. Um, obviously, not always possible, because clubs apparently are very rare cards to find. But don't forget about Square Joker. He's at 100 chips. The, the sad thing is, like, 100 chips. 50 times 6, 100 times 8, okay. 100 chips isn't even that much. We shouldn't have played. We could have gotten to 104 chips, bro. That's going to cost us four chips times our mult on every single subsequent. Oh, brother. I don't think the re-trigger is necessary. Maybe it is a straight flush build. I don't know. Maybe it is a straight flush build. We're cutting spades. Got a long way to go, of course. Literally none clubs. I mean, like, it's it, there's a conspiracy here. We will play straight flushes, maybe, so I, I do respect getting the Neptune. Seven spades and, and a billion of everything else. Sure, no problem. Maybe we play a diamond flush first, because it's readily available. This one, it, it's much different than the last one. I do feel like I'm on the razor's edge. Hear me out here. Discard? <laughs> I thought maybe they'd give us a flush house, but now that I look at it, that doesn't make any sense at all. Just put your multers in there. I, we gotta be a little bit more creative, because with, with four hand, four card straights... Ah! What? 
Are you kidding me? We lose? No, no, no. We don't lose. We don't. All we do is win. You play this for the mult. Told you. With four cards, straights, and flushes, you can play a, a flush and then add one offsuit card that's in sequence in order to create a straight flush. <coughs> this is what I wanted, but uh, To the Moon is already doing it. In the packs, I, I'm not that interested in the packs. Like here, we have a straight flush if we get one more club of any variety. So just hold the no, hold the nine and the ten. We got lucky, I think. Eight, nine, ten, Jack Queen. I know it's not incrementing square joker, but we gotta we gotta pick our battles, okay? That was a nice hand. Unless that's an ace, it's probably a club. I'm unwilling to believe that that we have a flush. Have to be a little bit more creative, I think. This should work. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Easy. Let's go. Okay. It's time to spend and it's time to uh, improve and it's time to replace some freaking jokers, man. Give me an emperor card. It's valueless. It's a joke. It could make a straight flush possible for us. Just don't convert clubs, okay? Next step. Literally, how about a, a hand I've ever played this run? <laughs> Makes me sick. Easier tarot cards to get is very good though, and the rerolls are already cheap. This is what we were hoping for. We're due, man. Okay, Moon is crazy though, and we're 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 straight flush pilled at this stage of our life. We're straight flush pilled. Nine ten Jack, Moon me. Eight nine ten Jack. It's already a straight flush, and it's four freaking cards. So we, we will put the four extra chips on its name. This is a puzzle, man. This, this one is not an easy task. Honestly, while we're here, check it out. Four, five, six, seven. Another straight flush. This time with hearts. And we're, we're, we're mostly clubs pilled. We're not going to remove clubs to add hearts. But we can remove spades to add hearts in a situation where it's relevant. I mean, I go greedy joker. It's just a worse version, but well, those are diamonds. We're not exactly diamond pilled. 48,000. I'm scared, man. Like, I feel like we're, we're tapped. This, you can't play it. I'm sorry. It, it's not playable. You have to dump it. What is this? Where's my clubs? There's 16 clubs left, man. One in every two cards is a club. No, oh, brother. <laughs> I don't think I can afford to just throw a hand into nothingness, which is unfortunate. What if you just drew a natural straight flush? That's not going to happen. Well, okay, I'll level with you, okay? We're kind of in hold our territory. Like, this is a guaranteed loss. I have to leave in 15 minutes to pick up my daughter from daycare. So we're going to try. We're going to make a good faith effort. 15 minutes is not a lot of time for a Balatro run. We're going to do what we can, okay? I was suffering from success on that last one. What, that's what you call it when you just lose? <laughs> Suffering from success. Yeah, I like the sounds of that. Me when I am slowly beaten by the game. In many ways, I'd say I'm suffering from success. They, it, honestly, no reason not to buy it. It's not the Joker of my dreams early on, but sure. It can be a little bit of a piggy bank for us. How about a little flush? My God, they did it. 
the madman. They called me a madman. Six dollars, brother. You can call me crazy if you want. In my house, that's the play. We can beat 600 points in three hands. Now it requires a little bit of luck, which is why we're thankful that we got the freaking... We, of course, we drew four hearts. That's why I'm thankful that we got one hand size, brother. Well, step one, dump these. That means you should dump the spade, okay. You're, you're, you're losing me my jury is what you're doing here. We're now out of discards. I didn't even discard five cards that time. This would be uh, a bit mirac not not a ton miraculous, but a bit miraculous to make it out. I think we literally did make it out. Can you believe it? Now you absolutely need to provide me with a joker that does anything. You do nothing. It uh, The only way we survive, I swear it to you, is you go Jupiter mode. And then I would love to buy the Celestial pack, but we, we need to have enough money to possibly buy a Joker uh, after this. It's the only way. Because like if, if we don't have a Joker by Big Blinds, we're going down, down in a luli low round, and Sugar, we're not going down swinging. We're going down quiet. So a Joker, a $6 Joker, $3 Judgment card. You made my decision for me. Popcorn will keep us alive, bro. You know what? Give me eight bucks and keep preserve popcorn a little bit longer. I'm as in awe as anybody that we have been granted survival from a benevolent otherworldly force. We got a long way to go considering we have one temporary Joker and it's anti-3. Well, um, let's start by buying Jupiter, and then maybe they would be so kind as to give me a Judgment card. They give me a Jupiter, which is pretty nice, but step one, I'm gonna Hermit, Fool, Hermit, so we get more purchasing power. And then this one, Judgment, you need it, man. That's not what I'm looking for, but it does inform that purchase at least. Another Hermit card has appeared in the shop, sure. How about a Strength card? I'm not using a reroll. let's enjoy the Econ. Let's be honest, we don't need a negative Joker. What do we need? A Joker. I know, it's confusing. It doesn't make sense, but here we are. Now what you gonna do with all that junk, all that junk inside your trunk? Oh, you mean my cards? I'm thinking strength card. I'm I'm trying to. I mean, we're so flush minded right now. We're trying to make sure. Yeah, it, on my two temporary jokers. Great idea. This is actually sick though. Whatever, just send it, brother. You'd be happy if it worked. We're trying to create easier flushes, which for me means we like strength in a situation when it creates two of the same suit. It should be spades, I suppose, now that I think about it. Um, actually, I, I can't even be mad about where we stand. We've been granted, like, another lease on life. It's not going to last forever. <laughs> but we're surprisingly still alive. This kind of goes sick on the black deck as well. And then red card, like, skipping packs for flat molt is kind of interesting. You know what? We've never really given it its credit. I know it's a bit of an insane play, but we've never really given it its credit. Let's give it a chance, okay? We'll take a steel card and then skip to get the three. That's the benefit of a mega pack. This one, sure, Jupiter would give us two mult. We'll take three instead. Spades are debuffed. Not optimal. We backed the wrong horse. But uh, I'm telling you, this is, especially if we're trying to go very, very fast, this setup is gonna do something for us. Credit card, I, I also think that something you do with credit card, plus one hand size again, I would love it. And then there is something to be said for like buying Constellation. 
buying the mega pack and just work with me on this one. Oh, because I'm going to be skipping packs like crazy. Maybe this is actually dumb. But then skipping the next one for the three malt, buying celestial pack, skipping again, and then selling the credit card to make more empty space for Joker stencil. These are crazy plays. But w watch this, brother. Mega standard pack. How about you give me one of these? Actually, spades are so good for us. How about you give me one of these? And then skip me for the three mult. A spectral pack. Hmm. A rare joker for negative $19. I could be persuaded. Honestly, don't be mad. I just don't think it fits the bill. Now, let's see. Let's see what we're dealing with. I thought that was going to clear it by like 30x. <laughs> I was like, it's the perfect situation. Okay, well, we have problems economically then, don't we? Yes, we do. What's the best way out of it? I don't have a good answer for you, but you're already at 21 multi times three. Maybe you, maybe you sell Constellation and just let it ride, bro. I can't, it's eternal. <laughs> no! Okay. I have, I have seven minutes and we're on anti five. I honestly thought there was a 0% chance we could conceivably have a, a good faith effort and an attempt to beat this run on anti eight, but we, we managed to, to put something together. That's undeniable. Whether it's good or not remains to be seen. It's got to be a great joker. Extra large blind is something I do not like to see. <laughs> it's got to be a great joker to get me to get rid of anything. If anything, I'm, at some point I'm looking forward to selling Wrathful Joker in order to take in order to pump up Joker stencil a little bit. I think I should not have taken Constellation. I'm willing to admit that now. We, we need malts. We need malt. The, the Constellation is for endless. Never forget that. Take your malt right now. Now, Death, if you gave me my super card, I would have taken it any day of the week. Sure, we could get two planets, but rather than get two planets, three more malts. Now, does this get us there? I have skepticism. We shouldn't play this flush. It has to be spades. Hold, hold. It's so doable. <laughs> you know what you play here? Six, two, six, six, two, full house. We need to draw four spades. And it would be very helpful if one of them was our super eight. We drew one spade. Y'all. <laughs> Folks, it's been an honor. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. We tried something a little bit out of the pocket on the speed run and it, I honestly thought it was working. I, and I think maybe if we didn't mess up and just snap pick constellation it still could be alive right now whether it would make it to the conclusion i don't know but for now thanks for watching hope you've enjoyed it if you did click the like button helps it a great deal subscribe if you want to see more in the future and i'll see you next time see ya